Right, folks, hopefully this is back in a better quality of um, video. People keep saying, why am I in 360? Don't know, just going round, I suppose. Um, so, I don't know, I think I'm back in whatever it is. I haven't got a fucking clue. All right, that's the way it works. I've obviously caught something on this camera. I don't know what I've done. It's just, it's done. But anyway, I've had a fiddle. Can't be a good fiddle, eh, June? Absolutely. What are you got in your mouth? Hey. What are you got in your mouth? Well, it sounds like you've got a load of gobstoppers. Uh, so, right folks, I am back with a food review. Yes, a food review. Not a beer review, but a food review. Don't forget to use the code BBM10 for your 10% off on beer hawk goods. Right. Um, so what I've done, folks, I was actually going to review these with Unky Steve, but Unky Steve is uh, a little bit poorly still. You, you, we will sort something out soon. Uh, McVitie's have got out new. Look, it says new. It says new, June. Yeah, it says new. You get 10 cakes, uh, and they are Auri Orange. I need to put the lights on. Can't see. Lights, action. Um, right, you get uh, 10 cakes, uh, 10 lightly sponge, 10, can oh, fucking glasses right. I've got to get to a proper optician instead of bloody own bargains. 10 light sponge cakes with dark crackly crackly chocolate and an orange and cranberry flavoured centre. Uh, yeah, apparently this is out for the Christmas. Um, that's if Boris doesn't cancel Christmas because he's cancelled the pubs at 10 o'clock. That's going to fucking help, isn't it, Boris? Hey, that's going to help big style. Yeah, because if that were me, if I were meeting Greaves here at 8, I'd just meet him at 7. And then whatever. It... Um, so anyway, yeah, I was going to review these monkey Steve, but still not very well. It's not COVID. Um, I think they cost me the grand total of a pound. Now, is it a Jaffa cake or is it a biscuit? Personally, I think it's a cake. The clues in the fucking title. Do you want to try one, Junior baby? I do. Well, come on then. So there it is. It's your standard Jaffa. Tastes like fucking other Jaffa cakes. Tastes like normal Jaffa cakes. What do you think, June? June's uh, assessing the situation. I'm masticating. Chewing. It's been known. Yeah, they do taste different. Do they? I thought they taste exactly the bloody same. No, they do taste different. Sorry for the slurp, folks. Tastes like marmalade. What are they? Well, funny enough, is it marmalade orange? Orange and cranberry. Yeah, they're a bit marmalade. So the taste of orange. Like a sweet marmalade. It tastes like a sweet marmalade. I personally think they taste exactly the same. Um, Could you still do a full box in one sitting? Yeah. Who couldn't? I don't know. It's ginger one. Um, so there you have it, folks. Um, probably one of the shortest reviews I'm going to do. Dip it in my tea. Oh, look, they've got a packet in there. Look, on the packet, on the clear, it says cranberry. Very good. Um, I'm not impressed. I do like Jaffa cakes. I don't get me wrong. I do love a Jaffa cake. Do you like Gin says they taste just the same. I think they taste different. They've got more of a... 
what? Got more than what? Grown up taste, I would say. A grown up taste, so it's yeah, got cranberry in it and it makes it grown up. I can't imagine kids would like them too. They much. taste the bloody same. They don't, they don't taste different to me. Do you're not a kid then, are you? It's probably the cranberry, isn't it? Because cranberries are quite. Did sad. you have to? Is that who's? Did they sing that? Did you have to let it linger? Is that the cranberries? Don't know. Put your comments in the answers. Hmm. No, to be fair, do you like me cut, folks? I went down the KP yesterday and bought myself the new uh, Leicester City maroon away top, and um, I seen that and thought I'm going to fucking have that. I know. Um, yeah, not impressed. Well, I am impressed, but they're just not what I expected. There seems to be. No, and that chocolate's not crackly. When you expect chocolate to be crackly, you expect it to be like the chocolate on a lolly. You know, like um, one of them salt and caramel things. Do you want another one, June? A nice, a nice lolly, you mean? Yeah. Yeah, a bit like the sort of texture of um, an after eight mint chocolate. Yeah. They do seem thicker though. They've got more sponge. Must be all that cranberry they've crammed into it. No, the actual sponge is thicker, look. Mm. Um, you might as well just buy a normal packet of chocolate cake, to be fair. No, they're nice. I wouldn't say they're not nice. No, that's what I'm saying. They're not nice, but they're just like a normal Jaffa cake. Mm. I bet, now there's a challenge for you folks, right? The Jaffa Cake Challenge. Get a plate of Jaffa Cake Yellers, uh, Jaffa Cake Orange and Cranberry, and a normal packet of Jaffa Cakes, and see if you can tell the difference. I'll tell you what, you could buy the, the Jaffa Cakes, and then when you get kicked out of the pub, that ain't mean, that don't mean like last orders at 10, that means you've got to be out, and the pub's got to be shut for 10. Uh, when you get home, you can do the challenge. Do the Jaffa Cake challenge. Is it, a, 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 is it an orange one or is it an orange and cranberry one? Oh, that's great, yeah, because you won't be drunk because you've just gone out at exactly the same time. It would have been a complete waste of time. Oh, for fuck's sake. Anyway, um, I will leave that one there whilst I'm just droning on. You don't like me droning on, do you, June? Right, folks, laters.